Hello, this is Nick with Nick'sComputerFix.com and here's a video on how to upgrade to Windows 10 Creators Update 2017 at your convenience. Okay, this is super easy. Let's go down to the Start menu, left click, and then we'll go up and click on the Settings icon. And once we do, that opens up the Windows Settings window. Move over and click on Update and Security. Once you do that, you'll get this window. And right down here, it's going to say, Good news, the Windows Creators Update is on its way. Want to be one of the first to get it. And then below here, it says, Yes, show me how. Go ahead and click on that which commences to open up the default internet browser within Windows 10. Mine is set to the Microsoft Edge browser and it opens up to this page. Windows 10 Creators Update is here and it gives you some information and you can also click on Upcoming Feature Page if you want to read some additional information. It's important that this tool does not support Enterprise Editions or Windows Server 2016. When you are ready, go ahead and click on the Update Assistant. And in Microsoft Edge, I get this uh, prompt down below here. And it basically says, what do I want to do with Windows 10 Upgrade 28085.exe? Gives me three choices. I want to click on Save. And when I do, it'll go ahead and run a security scan to make sure the file is good and healthy and uh, legit. And then it'll turn around and tell me that it's finished downloading um, that uh, file for me and gives me three choices. And I'm going to click on Run which starts the update assistant and it goes out and checks for the latest updates and then gives me this page update to the latest version of Windows 10 and gives me a little bit of information. Um, it tells me that this PC is running version 14.393 and the latest Windows version which it's going to upgrade to is 15.063. And then down below, it gives me some uh, choices, actually. I can cancel the upgrade right now, or I can go ahead and upgrade or update now. And that's what I'm going to do. And when I do that, it checks for compatibility. And then it says, congratulations, this PC is compatible. And I get three checks, OK, OK, OK. And um, it goes ahead and starts um, getting um, the update ready for this computer. So at this point, um, that's how you go about it. And it'll continue upgrading. And keep in mind that this does take about 90 minutes to complete. So allocate plenty of time. And uh, by the way, on another video, I will take you through all the steps from this point on. All right. In the meantime, subscribe if you like and leave a like if you like.